Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy Corey aka SBX and my video discussion I will talk about is gay marriage or just based on homosexuality and my point of view and my thoughts about it. No, it's not going to be a rant and I'm going to try not to discriminate gay people or bisexual or anything of that nature. So, um, pretty much in this country and pretty much worldwide or whatever, we, ha we have this little altercation with gay marriages and have a lot of issues going on towards gay people, period, based on their sexuality. I mean, put it like this, everybody's been gay since the Stone Age, basically. There was gay people in Egypt. That's why that's why they we had those menage trois and all that in France and whatever. It's like we had like gay mar like not gay marriage but just gay people in general been around for a long ass time. So back then it wasn't really we haven't talked much about it, but regardless, uh it was there. Nobody didn't really pay too much of a too much attention about it but it was there but however Christianity has an issue with gay marriage which is a it's, it's a sin which I get that and it, it, in the world really want to infiltrate people that it's an abomination how being gay is really bad because you're not supposed to have sex or being with a relationship with the same gender or marry the gender or have any other committed relationship with the same gender but to be honest like I, when I was younger I never was approved to gay people like you know you criticize them about the way they talk the, the feminine way how the men talk or the way they dress and how they talk and all that when, when, when you be around gay people for a long time like a lot of straight people like to assume that gay people will hit on the straight guys for sex or just to touch them or be just just like be kinky with it well that's not true of all with with all gay people you know they might say these things or whatever whatever but they know for a fact that you know you know you know you're straight so I feel like gay people know when to stay in their own lane I mean yeah, I had times where gay guys had hit on me which I thought that was really awkward like ugh. but to be honest though gay people can be very sincere like like when they mean what they say um, they make great friends they're funny as hell I mean gay people are, are something else though but like how I learn more and be respectful to gay people is when my sister had took me to this uh, park when we used to live in Atlanta Piedmont Park for all my people from ATL y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about but um, back then they had this little gay fest going on around there and I was like what the hell am I doing here there's a bunch of rainbows a lot of guys like, like the prima donnas and lesbians and all that I mean at first I'm like what am I doing here but by the time went by and I, when I socialized with gay people, I learned that you know not all gay people are cockthirsty or whatever like that. But then on top of that though, I saw the craziest fight when I was there. Two lesbians, you know, went all out when they, you know, like there was a stud versus the girl type lesbian and the girl knocked them fuck out of that stud like Dragon Ball Z punched her and just fly throughout the fucking air and just crash down to the fucking ground I mean that was the craziest fight ever so I feel like the more I've gotten to know gay people the more I can understand them because they pretty much they're all human but in America or whatever they're making it seem like gay people are like the new minorities of today's society like black people Asians and Mexicans, but then when you discriminate gay people, it's like I don't know since when gay people was a race. Since when 
now, now gay people get it in hard more than African Americans. Like, damn, gay people can't even get married. Um, and, and all that, but in America now, they're improving gay marriages on certain states, but sometimes it's always the South because we have asshole Republicans who wants to do things the the old-fashioned way, the coon the coon days, and the people who don't care about the minorities and care for people who are in the lower class or whatever like that in particular. But like I said. Since gay marriage is really there in America, I, to be honest, I don't really care. If you love the person for who that person is, that's all good and damn. But I won't catch myself being with a man. That's 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 my point of view. I like I, like I said, that's just my that's just my thing. I don't I don't really do that. I'm just strictly straight, strictly pussy. But if you guys out there who are undercover gay guys who are trapped in a closet. You don't have to be ashamed. You don't have to be ashamed about what you are. Even if your parents think, oh, well, that's a bad thing, and your dad wants you to be straight and all that other stuff, because clearly they're the ignorant ones. Clearly they don't know that you're different from other people. So, um, I mean, it's, that's life, basically. If people choose to be gay, let them be gay. I don't understand why people like the Christians and other religion and different countries want to ban that. Because it's no way in hell you're gonna you could ever ever ban gay marriage and gay people in general. That's just that's just it. Because you know I feel like yeah, the gay people will answer to God, but hey, that's only God's turn. Hell, he might bring the gay guys to heaven. I feel like gay people should have a chance to go to heaven because. I mean, the only thing they just do is just, you know, have sex with their own gender, like, whatever, whatever, but in deep, in deep, in deep inside, they're good people, they try to live their life like everybody else, you act like they're fucking, like, aliens or any type of monsters or whatever, not anything that is not human, I mean, clearly gay people don't go gay people in life, if it wasn't for gay people, we wouldn't have any good fashion, we wouldn't have, like, certain music, even though I don't approve to some of the bullshit. We wouldn't even use fag or whatever, just say gay slang words like, that's gay, or food. I mean, gay people can cook their ass off, do hair, all of that. Like, I'm telling you, you need gay people in this world. I mean, maybe it's, it'll give you color and all that, but I'm just gonna be just deep down. I have no animosity towards gay people at all. So that's all I got to say for my video. Make sure you comment, subscribe, and let me know what you think on this uh, topic. Until then, SBX wrapping this shit up. Thank you for watching. Peace and God bless. Have a gay day.